Welcome to LeShare. In the following couple of minutes, we would like to briefly introduce the laser-based assessment of NextCut. Welcome. Could you please introduce yourself? I'm John Blackburn. I'm from TWI Limited, and I'd like to introduce to you the project NextCut. NextCut is a project which is looking at diode laser cutting. The equipment is being supplied by Lima, and the end user is Laser Expertise. Laser Expertise are a job shop in the UK, and to add to that, we also have EWF, who will look at the wider application of this technology to other job shops throughout Europe. So far, we have successfully laser cut a wide variety of sheet metals commonly found in job shops. These include in construction steel, stainless steel, copper, aluminium and nickel alloys. The cut quality is comparable to fiber laser and cutting speed matching or exceeding CO2 laser. Good progress has been made according to project plan and materials for production simulation are being prepared by laser expertise. The production simulation will be carried out in the second quarter of 2015 at TWI and at laser expertise. Comparison will be made between diode laser and CO2 laser on both cut quality and productivity. How has the issue the LEA should solve been handled before the LEA set in? So direct diode lasers have been used in other laser processing applications for quite low power densities, cladding and surface treatment. Lima have developed a, a new laser technology which allows us to, to focus it down into a power density which we can do cutting applications with. And this is through the product that they call Diocut. The technology has been demonstrated at a lab level but has not yet been demonstrated at an industrial level for cutting of typical metallic materials, stainless steel, carbon mild steel, aluminium alloys. Direct diode laser in the past did not have sufficient beam quality and laser power for cutting application. With the research and development carried out at LIMO, we can now cut metals using direct diode laser. To bring the technology to production level and provide commercial confidence in using diode laser for cutting, the next cut project was formed as one of the assessments under La Chere. At the end of the project, we will have a robust diode laser cutting system and laser cutting parameters suitable for production in job shops. Please clarify the objectives of your assessment and how the market will benefit from it. So the goal of the next cut assessment is to perform simulation production trials using the diode cut system at TWI Limited. We will compare the results that we get with the diode cut system to those which we get with the incumbent technology, CO2 lasers and also the competing technologies such as fiber disc lasers and water jet cutting. The potential benefit to the end users is very high. Not only will they get increased uh, return on investment for decreased capital costs, they will also get decreased running costs because they have higher warp plug efficiency but they will also potentially benefit from increased cutting speeds because of the higher absorption that the laser light produced by the diode cut technology.